if you just imagine what this looks like, it's going left to right. And that's because the X is in front. And then my center is the opposite of that, the opposite of that, meaning it's positive three, negative four. This is really great just to start getting an image in your mind of like what the asymptotes are. They're lines that go through that center, like in, in this way, kind of hugging the asymptote. And we already have a point, all we need is the slope. How do we get the slope? This is the rise, whatever value is under the Y, this is the run, meaning the slope is that over that or two fifths. So the first one using points of Y minus negative four, which is Y plus four is equal to two fifths times X and then minus that three. And then what they like to do in the back of the book is they just move that four over. So they make it Y equals two fifths X minus three minus four. And then the second asymptote is the exact same in terms of the X minus three and the minus four because it's using the same point, but the slope is negative. So we just change that to negative two fifths. 